Hi guys, it's Gabby Briars here, and today I'm doing a tag done by Model Horse Love on Instagram and YouTube. Her name is Chelsea, she's awesome, go follow her. So this is a stablemate tag video, and I have the questions in front of me, hopefully, on my phone. And so, I'm going to just jump right into it. The first question is your first five favorite um, stablemate models. And so I'm going to start with my Bay Django. He's a regular run from, I believe, last year. Um, he's just gorgeous, and I love how dark and nice he actually is for a regular run. He has a really, really cute star and a snip. So he's one of my babies. I congo this mold, which you will see later. Um, then my second favorite would have to be Finch, who I got in a trade for um, Darley, I believe, of the Collector Club, or the Stamate Club. But I do want to buy another one. But this guy is absolutely gorgeous. He's the mini D uh, Dundee. His name's Darwin. I've named him Finch. I don't know if I mentioned that. And then we have this guy, who is a custom by Kingston Studios, I believe, on Instagram and YouTube as well. Um, he is a Suffolk Punch on the standing vaulting drafter mold. He's gorgeously done. Um, he has a funny story behind him. I actually saw him in 2012 and said, oh, I love this guy. I really, really want him. And I got him by accident in a trade for a lady phase that I had. Oops, sorry, the lighting changed. I guess a cloud went by. Um, and then we have this guy who is another um, G2 stand or vaulting drafter, G3. I don't know what gen it is. He is a little roan. He is probably my favorite statement in my collection since I didn't do it in order. But he's absolutely gorgeous and he is from the WEG run, I believe. I'm sorry, I'm so bad at this. Um, then lastly, we have Carling, which is another one of my favorites. I got him in the Ninja Pit of Death 2017 for like 12 bucks, so like original pricing. And I love this guy. I love stable mates and gloss especially, and he is just adorable. So, on to the next question, which is my least favorite stable mate. It would have to be this guy. He he sticks around because he places really really well. He's nanned, I believe, four times right now, but he just continually gets scuffs. And but his color is really really neat, and I really think he's just. He, he's neat, but like the mold is just not my favorite. And then we have three molds. Hmm. Which one is this? Three favorite stablemate molds. Sorry, my bad. So first we have the Django, and this guy is just the regular run, um, Appy, uh, what's it called? Like blind bag stablemate. And I have a bunch of these guys. I need to get a couple customized. Then we have a mini Albi which I love this mold not as a unicorn but I just love it in general because I love the big guy and so I love that they made a mini me and the second mini me oh I let the kitty go <laughs> um then we have my mini Brishin who is also from another blind bag set and I just love when Briar does these mini me's I think it's my favorite thing ever and I just, I can't wait for them to do more. There you go. And then, we have your least favorite uh, stablemate molds, which would have to be, again, this guy, just because he's so cartoony and so blobby. Really just, eh. Cartoon molds don't really get my goat. Is that saying? I don't know. <laughs> then this girl, I love draft horses, but this girl's just insanely tippy. And so she's actually the only one I have on this mold. Um, just because her color is kind of to die for. And she's one of my favorites. She shows really, really well as well. Um, and then this guy. Again, just cartoony. Kind of like bubbly. I like Generation 1 molds. And he's, I think, Generation 2, 3, something like that. But this guy, actually, he has a lot of sentimental values. So he does, does stick around. And then I believe the next question is, do I have any stablemate congas, which I will show you right now. So I just did my congas that are two or more. 
So we have my little gypsy conga, and then my conga of nine of these G2 stand, uh, vaulting drafters. The one who's looking really, really washed out on camera is done by High Altitude Studios on Instagram. Um, this guy is done by Kingston Studios, and this little guy is done by me. And then we have my OFs, and then we move on to my mini Albies, which I have a bunch more bodies that are getting customized right now. And then we have my Django's and a little Lotus, and I also have a bunch more bodies that I need to get customized on this mold, so, yeah. So, the second to last question is, what are my top three stable mate grails? And I think it would have to be Django, the original one at the top, which I will try to show a picture here, hopefully. Um, my, a mini True North, sorry, my cat just got up on a shelf. Um, the Mini True North and the Collector Club new uh, mold that they're coming out the Cleveland Bay. I am so excited for that horse. I haven't even seen the color on him, but I know that mold is just going to be to die for. And then the last question on the list is, what is the horse that shows the best for you? And it would have to be this little girl. Her name is Germany. She is a little itty bitty pony in blue roan and she has won I think four NAND cards and a mini division champ. She is NAND and placed at every single show I've brought her to so she she's just a cutie and I love her and I love her so much. Anyway that is the last question of this stablemate tag and again go fodl fodl Follow Model Horse Love um, on Instagram and YouTube. She's awesome. She created this tag. So, nice seeing you guys. Bye.